Yo, welcome to my channel. My name's JD and I'm an artist from Bristol in the UK. And today we've got a bit of a different video for you. So I'm on my way, armed with my camera, some snacks, nice big drink, and I'm also sun creamed right up because today is a boiling hot day. It's a nice hot day here in Bristol, UK. And I am on my way up to Bedminster for this year's Upfest 2021. So it's been a bit of a different Upfest this year. We're not doing the big one event over the weekend this time. This year is 75 paintings on walls over 75 days. Just spread out. Apologies for the noise. It's a fire engine. We have 75 walls in 75 days, spread out due to the pandemic and stuff. But I have noticed quite a few pieces actually already finished. I noticed a few pieces being painted the other day. So I decided we're gonna go around and just take a look at Upfest 2021 and see what's going on, see the pieces that have been finished and hopefully catch some being painted in action too. And just in case, we miss anything i'm probably going to record this over the week so hopefully you'll see some progress and then maybe the finished piece as well and yeah hopefully you guys will enjoy this obviously if you do smash that thumbs up button and yeah let's crack on let's get there so i'm starting this little venture down at the bottom of north street actually right by ashton gate and the park opposite but this way, I can walk all the way around North Street. Sorry about that. But this way, we can walk from the bottom all the way up North Street and hopefully not miss too many pieces. So let's go. So straight away as I'm walking up, I can see someone painting there in the background. And there's also one been done here. I think this is the house. Yeah, yeah. Um, Paul Monsters, is, ah yeah, collab. Unfortunately, we've got some scaffolding over this one at the moment, but the piece looks pretty finished. So I reckon I'll probably remove this soon. Sick. I'll try and come back when the scaffolding's over. All done. We've got scissor lift. We've got a piece in action here. And like I said, we'll be coming back throughout the day so you'll see this a little bit more finished more throughout the video let's roll this one's just been started by the looks of it just getting some paint on the walls and I'll probably keep saying this through the video but like I said we'll come back day by day see the progression take you along for the journey now this one's from last year one of my favorite artists insane 51 and he does this cool red and blue. If you have the glasses, do the red, you only see the blue. And if you look through the blue, obviously you only see the red. But honestly, such a good artist. He's actually painting one just around this corner. So we'll see that shortly. was one of the first pieces to have been done. Well, cool.
got some live painting people. We got it live. Here are the six sisters, recently finished, looking sick. Now this is one of my favourites. I love a bit of SP0. That cartoony style just speaks to me. Now this is from the Robot Apocalypse, this one. And it is sick. Also got the little beaver electrical there. Some of these are from last year, but I thought I'd stick them in anyway because they're so cool. See a scissor lift. Maybe there's something going up here. Head back down sometime in the week. <laughs> So this might not be up first, but look how sick that is. And I am a massive Jurassic Park dinosaur fan. So cool. This is Dean Lane. Some sick paintings going on down there. There's a little gem hidden down by Dean Lane here. These things are everywhere around Bristol. Follow my rabbits. And I swear they're just like bunnies. Everywhere. It's now lunch time and I'm just going to sit down in this park, find a nice little shady spot just here in amongst all this sunny field. Just going to stay out of the sun and answer the question you are probably all wondering, what snacks do I have? Well let me show you. So I've got some pretzels, sour cream and chive, get me, and some white chocolate cookies. So let's eat.
Oh, I see another cherry picker by a big wolf. I guess it's not yet, my last. See with this piece, we started out in the red. This is the insane thrifty one, and you can see all the little tabs of tape. I'm sure that's some sort of doodle grid for him, or some sort of way of mapping something out before he does it. Cider. I've got some free beer to give away. Oh, you're kidding. I designed the label. coming along pretty sick and this will be the end of day two so I'll see you in day three. So today we've come down to St. Werber's because we've heard that Inky is down here graffitiing with none other than Goldie so we're gonna take a little look around here and see what's going on.
So we're here day four at Upfest and unfortunately last night or early hours of the morning Upfest was subject to vandalism basically. Apparently many of the 75 walls have actually been vandalized as you could probably see behind me here. And they've said they're gonna try and sort of save the art and see what they can do to save it but I mean it's just ridiculous why would people do this? I feel privileged and lucky that I managed to get to capture a lot of this stuff probably before it got vandalized. Unfortunately, I didn't manage to catch this one before it got done, but I am so glad we can actually see this and I can share with you what they looked like before they were vandalized and hopefully I'm gonna have a look round and not too many of them have been done. I mean, it's just a joke, isn't it? I don't want this to be a negative video. I'm not gonna go around and show you all of the vandalism. I might show you a couple of bits just to give you the example of what it's like but I mean we just want to see this art in all its glory so that's what we're going to be giving you. So yeah hopefully there'll be a few pieces that have been finished so let's go check it out. So like I said I'm not going to be showing you too many of these just because it is really depressing, really sad, but this is the sort of that people have done. And unfortunately, this amazing piece of artwork has been ruined. It's gonna be difficult to save this piece. So it's the last day, this is day five, and today is gonna be the last day I'm gonna take you around up fast. And I know that most of the pieces have been finished, so we're gonna go around and find all those. And I've also noticed some on Facebook that I've actually missed. So we're gonna try and hunt those down too. But yeah, this is the last day. Hopefully you enjoyed this video so far. Let's check out the last pieces. <music> this one still has the scaffolding up but as you can see it's an amazing piece unfortunately this being the last day this is how you're going to see this piece in this video but maybe i'll do a part two if i see some more you never know These aren't up fast, but they're in the local area and they look sick, so I thought I'd show you.
are back. So that pretty much sums it up for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed following me along for Upfest 2021. If you did, as always, it'd be wicked if you smash that thumbs up button, give it a like, and it'd be sick if you could subscribe too. And also, if you tick the little bell notification icon, you will be the first person to know when my next video drops. So until next time, stay safe out there, and I'll see you in the next one.